to apply eyeliner. Defining the eyes is a sure way to change your look and emphasize your eyes. It isn't for nothing that the eyes are called the windows of the soul. Framing your eyes draws people's eyes towards yours, just as window dressing draws the eyes of passersby. Knowing how to apply eyeliner will enhance your appearance and your appeal. Here are the steps. 1. Know your tools. Eyeliners come in pencil, liquid, or cream form that's applied with a brush. Each has a distinct look and applied differently to achieve a different effect. Pencil eyeliners are the easiest to use and are versatile. Pencil liners must be kept sharp. A worn down pencil won't write, will stretch the skin, and is painful. Sharpening also cleans the tips from bacteria that may accumulate there from frequent use. Pencil eyeliners are useful for creating a softer look, especially as it tends to blend into the rest of your eye makeup as the hours pass. Liquid eyeliners are darker, bolder, and sharper. There are two kinds of liquid eyeliner brushes, soft or hard. The soft brush is flexible and easier to handle than the hard one, although sometimes it's just a matter of preference. Regardless of brush type, liquid eyeliners will give your eyes extra definition, and although it is useful for daily use, you really get the most benefit when using it for dramatic looks, such as for the classic, gorgeous cat eye effect. Cream eyeliner offers more color options and may be applied like the liquid eyeliner, but with an eyeliner brush. It can double as eyeshadow and lends itself to various and versatile uses, particularly for fantasy makeup. But the neutrals will always be a standby and can be used for the simplest look as well. 2. Start with a clean face after your concealer, foundation, and pressed powder have been applied. Once your eye makeup is on, you're three quarters done in your makeup routine. You can't turn back and wash, so do it right, right from the start. You need to be careful about the eye area because it is prone to infection and your eyes are too precious to risk injury. 3. Use your dominant hand to hold the tool, your other hand to hold the skin steady, and apply your eyeliner. To hold the skin around the eye steady, press a finger of your free hand on the skin a little above the area you're working on. Press down lightly with just enough pressure to keep the skin from shifting. As much as possible, avoid stretching the skin to any direction or pulling it taut. With practice, you will find that it's possible to apply eyeliner without stretching the skin. 4. Line the upper eye lash line. When using pencil, draw a line from the inner to the outer corner in three strokes. First from the inner corner and one-thirds toward the center of the eye, then from that point to two-thirds above the eye, then continue from there to the outer corner. This minimizes the chances that your hand will shake and result in a crooked line. You may go back to make the line thicker or darker, and you may also make the outer corner a bit thicker. Then set the line with the same color of eyeshadow so that it won't melt away. You can also go for a softer effect by using a finger to smudge the pencil line so it doesn't look harsh. For eyeliner applied with a brush, it is best to start about one-third from the inner corner going out, and then going back and drawing a line from the inner corner to the point where your first line left off. The eyeliner brush is best for making a flick at the outer corner to get the swoosh look. Or, if you're more daring, try this. Draw a line from the outer corner diagonally up toward the crease. Then draw a line from the middle of the upper lash line to meet the top of the diagonal you just drew. This will create a triangle. Fill the triangle up with eyeliner and you have just made yourself a cat eye look. 5. To line under the eye, you can either draw a line in the inner rim of the eye or just under the lashes. You have the option of lining the entire rim or under the lash line, or only two-thirds toward the outer corner. You may even leave it out altogether. Alternatively, you may also use a different color liner, depending on the effect you want to achieve. Once you get the routine down pat, you can experiment and try new styles, new colors, new combinations, and other variations. There's no reason to be intimidated in learning how to apply eyeliner, it can make or break a look, and as long as you're wearing makeup, why not rather go for make than break?